In this video, we are going to see how ants build their underground nests. Here we have a colony of ants just starting to build their nest. The first thing they need to do is dig a hole in the ground. And to make that job easier, they secrete a sticky substance called formic acid, which helps break down the soil. Once the hole is deep enough, the ants will start bringing soil back to the surface, creating an anthill. But there's more going on below the surface. As the ants continue to dig, they create tunnels that extend outward in all directions. These tunnels are used to transport water, food, and waste. They also serve as a highway for the ants to travel back and forth from the surface. Now let's take a closer look at what's happening above ground. Here we can see worker ants carrying food back to the nest. They're also digging tunnels, but these tunnels are much smaller. They're used to transport water, food, and waste. Now let's go back below ground and see how the nest is developing. As the ants continue to dig, they create chambers that are used for different purposes. Some chambers are used for storing food, while others are used for raising the queen's eggs. The chambers are connected to the tunnels, allowing the ants to move freely throughout the nest. Let's take a closer look at the tunnels. They're not just holes in the ground. The ants line the tunnels with soil that's been treated with formic acid. This makes the tunnels more durable and helps prevent them from collapsing. The tunnels also have a ventilation system that allows fresh air to circulate through the nest. Let's take a look at the different types of chambers. The main chamber is where the queen lays her eggs. It's also used for storing food and raising young. The satellite chambers are used for storing food and other supplies. They're also used as nurseries for newly hatched ants. The ants use pheromones to communicate with each other. They leave scent trails that other ants can follow to find food and resources. Pheromones are also used to mark the boundaries of the nest. This helps to keep the ants organized and prevents them from fighting each other. Now let's take a look at the different types of ants. There are many different species of ants, but they all share some common characteristics. Ants are social insects that live in colonies. They have a queen that lays eggs and worker ants that help take care of the nest and its inhabitants. Most ants are black or brown, but some can be red or even green. Now you know how ants build their underground nests. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more nature videos.